I'm Pastor Bafar and uh, my project is Special Emotional Recognition Based Music Recommendation System. So in this project, there are, the outline is here, introduction and problem statement, who are you, the two modules, and how these modules work, and finally we come to the evaluation. Uh, first we come to the emotions. What are emotions actually? Because this project is mainly related to the emotions, the sentiments, so we will talk about the emotions. Emotion is any conscious experience characterized by mental activity and it has a certain degree of pleasure or displeasure. Here are some different kinds of emotions, quite a lot. But what we are interested in, we are interested in seven kinds of emotions, ranging from happy to sad, surprise, anger, fear, and neutral, we also classify neutral as an image. So these are different people, you can see some are happy, disgust, fear, these are the emotions. And human beings exhibit these emotions using facial expressions, right? So we want to use those facial expressions for music recommendation. And also people listen to different types of music, depends on their moods, and their moods is visible from the face, right? So we will use those facial expressions for the recommendation of music. Uh, coming to a system, uh, the problem uh, statement, uh, in a normal environment, an individual has to play music according to his mood, right? This is like people are obsessed with making things automatic. So here we want to automate the process of selecting a music. We want that music to be selected automatically. This is the process, like you want to press a button and play the music, but we don't want to do this. We want to do this. You look into a camera and the music is played automatically according to your mood. This is what basically we want to do. Uh, this is the system review. How will the system work? There are two modules. One is the facial expression modules, facial expression recognition modules. These modules will extract the emotion from the face. The next is the uh, music recommendation module. This module will recommend the music based on this extracted emotion. And finally, it will play the song. So, this is the basic overview of this system. <clears throat> So facial expression module and music recommendation module. How this facial expression recognition module will work? Here, uh, first we will detect the face and extract it. How? Uh, from the camera, we will extract the environment. And from the environment, we will then detect the faces. Where are the faces? When we detect the face from those detected faces, we will then extract the feature. And through those, those features, we will extract the emotion. So first we will detect the face and extract it. And also then the next, next step here is image enhancement. After enhancing the images, we will pass it through a convolutional neural network, which will give us the features and also a model. And that model will then help us to uh, identify these emotions. So this is basically how this project will work. Two publicly available data sets are used for it. One is called JEFT and that's Karolinska. Uh, this is Japanese female database and the other is also from a lab. And both these data sets are posed images, like image here, that's wild, but these are posed. So this is one kind of drawback of the system, which I will discuss later. And uh, there is another uh, problem which we want to focus. If there is like a multiple sitting here, so how will this system will work? So we extract all the faces in the same way. We use the probability of each picture emotion as well. I have derived a formula for this that how we will calculate it. For all the pictures in the, uh, for, in the setting, we will extract the faces and for each emotion then we will weigh it. So this is a formula which we, I have developed. And how this is how for multiple faces this system will work. Uh, the next is the song module. So first the song classification. Two methods we can use for song classification. The first one is extract feature from the SAM and then classify it according to those emotions. That's quite a difficult task. And the second one is we manually do the classification, like we, we take some people, some participants, and they do the, their, their task for us. And this study, I have used an openly available data set called Revdesk for this purpose. And Revdesk, the songs are exactly classified based on the emotion, is the earlier module which will do classification. So I don't need to do any uh, one one uh, things. These songs are like exactly uh, classified as the original module. 
The next one thing is song recommendation. So there are two methods through which I can recommend a song. One is random recommendation in each class. Like this is the class, now how should I select a song? So that is random, random selection. The second one is recommendation based on the environment. So to do this, we will do like, uh, we will give a score to uh, each environment. For example, I have three environments. One is home, office, and a coffee break. So for to each song, we will give some weight, right? Uh, like this one, if uh, for office, song two is the highest score. So this one is highest score, so this song will be played. Kind of priority. A's or data set does not contain these weights, see? Right? So we will we have choose a random method for this. The next is, uh, I will also talk about like how can we choose this weight and how can we obtain these. The evaluation. There are two uh, uh, step evaluation. The first step is the facial expression module evaluation. I earlier developed this model, so I have some results from that. We have developed, uh, we have uh, evaluated it through precision, we call an F1 score, and I have also drawn the ROC curves for all these uh, emotions. This was kind of my earlier project of uh, a year ago, so I have some results from that, and I have included it for, in this report, that how this, uh, how can we obtain those results, evaluate this uh, project. The next step evaluation is this one how we will evaluate the overall system. We will have a setting. The setup will be like a coffee shop or office break or home. And any every, every environment, there will be 10 to 15 people setting, right? And multiple cameras will be used in there. Each experiment will be repeated for several emotions. And participants will be asked to make certain facial emotions. And after that, we will ask them to fill a questionnaire. What will be a questionnaire? I have developed a questionnaire for that. The first question will be guessing music emotion. From this question, we will know that what kind of emotion uh, the, uh, he can guess rightly or wrongly, right? The song is playing, whether he's guessing it right or wrong. The second one is rate the music emotion. We cannot rate it like this is angry song, this is um, happy or sad. We can do some like uh, low, high things. Like this song is 2% angry, or 2 level angry, and 3% disgust, or 2% this. So from here, we can get some idea there. How this music is. The third question is on a scale of one to five, how the music is related to your facial emotions. What is your mood and how, how it is related to your emotion. So from here you will get this. The last question is on a scale of one to five, relate the music to the environment. Earlier we talked about like we don't have this in our data set. So we can use backward propagation and then we can redevelop our system using this data. The final is some kind of interface which I just made it and this is, I haven't developed it, but this is what I have in my mind. From here, we will get the environment. Here, we will extract the face. Based on this face, we will extract, uh, we will have some probabilities from the model. And the best of this, we will have like this is the happy emotions. On the best of this, we will have some kind of song playing in that environment. So, this is how the environment will work. And uh, thank you. This is all for today. Questions? Okay.